Hello and welcome to the Real Life Side podcast with me, Eddie Dewar. Me, Ash Gould. Me, Zane Groves. Me, Rob Lee. Me, Ricky Grover. Episode 10, season 2. Yeah, that went Flying, smooth, didn't it? it? That went smooth, didn't it? Yeah, that went very smooth. Zane was half asleep. You right, mate? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's a bit knocked off your stride. Exactly. Someone special in the building, that, isn't it? I think that pause yeah. was for impact, though, I think. It was. How yeah. was it for impact? Like I like, Radio a, 4, I like was a strong, it? silent yeah. impact. Yeah. Zane. It's all that. It's all that. <laughs> Zane. Zane. I know he's got his check shirt on today. He's looking mustard. Exactly. It's Rob's shirt. Did your missus get you dressed yeah. this morning? No, I've got myself dressed this morning. I, I could tell. <laughs> <laughs> all in grey, isn't he? Poor. <laughs> sit, sit with financial advisor. Look at him, all in grey. <laughs> exactly. Take the mic out of the tight oh, jeans no, last week. Really. It's all going wrong. We love you, really. Right, lads, what are we going to talk about this week? Well, not football. No. No? no. no well, I'm going to be truthful, right? I'm on strike. I'm on strike because I've tried, I've tried to watch from it. What? I've been <laughs> trying to watch what? it. Yeah, exactly. What it's went? unwatchable uh, shit. Yeah, see. It is so tell me how you really feel about shit. it. I watched. I, I tried, the England game wasn't worth two bob, and I've, I've had enough of football, mate. I, I, I don't even want to talk about it no more. But you talk about it. We are a football show. Yeah, but Harry so Kane did score, about? Rick. So ah, again. And Rashford did very well. Harry Kane. Oh. <laughs> your mate. Yeah, Rashford. Yeah, he I mean, great, yeah, yeah, it's, it's coming said, true. Your, that's your a given, prediction. isn't it? Rashford always does well. But I, I, I think he'd be better off going into acting or something. Yeah, yeah, well, have you, pa- have you like painted your fingernails? Up. No, do you know what I've done? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I've done, do you? <laughs> For those who don't it's know, dirt. I, really, I really ate dirty fingernails, right? So I was just in the cab with my daughter, Lauren, and I noticed I had a little dirty fingernail. I just had to go and film something for Joe Brand. And I said, have you got anything, Lauren, to do me fingernails? And I was trying to say it in code because I had the driver next to me. And you didn't want to keep it. You want to say you got any nail clippers and all that. Yeah. Yeah. And and Lauren gave me a biro pen. And while I tried to clean me nails with the pen, and now I've got black nails on both hands. No, you know, it's I really doing my nut. <laughs> <laughs> now, yeah. It might catch on, though. <laughs> yeah. Next year, it might it could catch on. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it I all, the, so all, bad, yeah. all the kids would be doing it. Yeah, yeah. 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 Very yeah. gothic, Rick. Very gothic. Very gothic, Very gothic isn't it? Yeah. So, listen, International Week has been a bit of a bar fest. Holland out. I could tell by Ledger's yeah. demeanour. Well, I'm a bit of a rig this week. I haven't watched much of it. I sat down to watch Wales versus Ireland. Were you on strike as well? Well, from England I am, yeah, because it's boring at the moment, isn't it? Yeah. Harry Kane apart, I think it's a bit yeah. dull. Yeah. There's not much going on really. We 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 were definitely gonna qualify. Yeah. And, I've uh, gotta say though, world, isn't it? I've gotta say Easy group. I Easy thought group, yeah. Harry Kane was exciting until I heard him talk. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that oh, geezer yeah. that geezer could <laughs> send you asleep, couldn't yeah. he? No, like he, he can't be perfect, can Matt he? Matt he's got, he's like got a big tongue though, somebody swapped a whale's tongue and put it in his mouth. <laughs> yeah. That's why. <laughs> I'm not being funny, but That's your favourite player by Ginola. It's your favourite player. Exactly. That's ridiculous, yeah, no, what's, what's wrong with Ginola? You then? want to ask Mrs. Groves about my Ginola shrine at home. Oh my god. That's and I've seen it, let's to be fair, yeah. I've still got his number, but you're still not having it. Don't give it to him. He will get done. <laughs> Rob likes to keep that for himself. <laughs> exactly. He's, he's not a team player. Right? No, no. So what are we going to do then, lads? Let's just sit here and talk about... Well, what did you week. do this weekend, Ed? Do you know what? I had a great weekend. No, I'm lying. Saturday, I went to watch the boy play. Yeah. And um, it was a local derby against Cheson FC. And we lost. You lost? Yes, we Well, lost. I wonder why you're so quiet See, about your mean, team. Our, our we never hear football. when he loses, by the way, do we? How boring is football? No, that, even we, we your lost. story, we that's lost. about your own son. You'll mm, be yeah, ashamed yeah. of yourself. Yeah, you should have done something no, to no, up. It was terrible. And the you thing should have run on the pitch and chin yeah. the ref. And you said you had a great You said you had a great He was the ref. You should have done something. You can't just leave it like that. No, it was terrible. It was terrible. That's boring, mate. He's still grounded, obviously. Yeah, he hasn't eaten since last weekend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ash has got some interesting stories. Oh, you want to know? Well, I want to know. Just before we went on air, we were talking, and out the blue, as Ash always does, come out with a statement. I think there was a reason, but I can't. No, it wasn't. It wasn't. No, there was no reason. There was no reason. Zero like reason. Like you're, you're, like you're <laughs> always, you're always just chipping in yeah, about it. nonsense. Yeah. But he's the intelligent one. No, actually, he was. My daughter's here today, and we was talking about her being a photographer. Oh, horses, yeah. Taking photos horses, of dogs, yeah. and she might, <laughs> have, she might do <laughs> horses. And, and then out the blue, well, no, because we talk about horses biting you, and then I remember the story when I went to Go grab on. a bull by the horns to see what all the fuss wait is a minute, about. Wait a minute, wait a minute, stop, stop, stop. You know, at which point did you decide it well, was cool to Well, I live opposite a bull, so it was there for ages. And you live opposite a bull? I did do, yeah. You did? I did, yeah, in Where? Finchley. 
There's a farm in Finchley. Oh, in go Finchley. out. Yeah. yeah, there's a farm in Finchley. You must have been stoned out of your nut, mate. Well, <laughs> there ain't no farms in Finchley. There's a pub called Ball. There's a pub called Ball. There's a pub called Ball. There's a pub called there. Well, it looked like a ball. And <laughs> anyway, so the, it was come up to the fence. I got a bit of grass and bought yeah. it, you know, just from the side, not grass, you know. Yeah. And, uh, <laughs> what kind of grass, that? Yeah, no, just normal. Yeah, go on. And I grabbed its horns. And what happened? And it... Wobbled its head, and there was no way you could even hang on for a second with a, a bull. It's got you a sure strong, want a cow, a strong neck. Sure, you want a cat, <laughs> sure, want a sheep. No, it had a big <laughs> horse. Had, had horse. No, it was big. I believe because yeah, that sh- Highland uh, thing, Scot- is it, Scottish as well. Yeah, so oh, know, it was a big old Angus. Angus. It was a big old Angus. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it was a big one. Yeah, well, they're quite small, they're quite short, but they're stocky. Are they? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah you, so, you once you grabbed it by the horns, what happened? I had to quickly take my hands off the horns or you know what, and you know, legged it. it was like you know they're quite pointy as well and they're quite hard sort of you know what i mean because is that saying like grab the bull by the horns yeah, obviously yeah, so what, 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 what was that the bull by the horns was that was that uh, the reasoning behind your yeah, well it's what i see i reckon i could hold i thought i could hold it but what did that have to do with lauren taking pictures i don't even understand well, what's going like, on uh, no. so lauren could do because she's going into dog photos like you know yeah I said, well, what about horses? And we started talking, start, because, you know, it's good money in taking pictures of horses. Yeah. And then my mate, because it? It, it was this... <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. oh, oh, it's a function. Oh, I didn't know that. Someone See, said, Les, he's the brain well, of, of a horse. Uh, and then, it's actually, the honest we should, we, 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 Really, I've we got, should be talking about horses, yeah, everybody. Really, I don't I've, know why we're talking about honest, football. I've got no affluent um, clients that are into taking pictures of horses. Really? Mm. No, interestingly enough, no. 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 Well, listen, my daughter's up for it, so... I mean, when I say up for it, she's up. <laughs> <laughs> no, fuck off. <laughs> fuck off. That's a liberty. <laughs> she's up for taking pictures of horses, all right? Yeah. <laughs> you see, see Rob's eyes light up. Look <laughs> 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 at that, a kid in a seat shot. Oh, dear, 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 dear. Oh, on that note. Um, yeah, yeah, so yeah, yeah. yeah well, <laughs> should we talk about Messi's uh, 444 hat trick then? 444? No, 44th hat trick. Who's that? He's unbelievable. Messi. Isn't it? Messi. When yeah, his team is struggling, you can always count on the was, top player. was saying that Scotland went out because his players were too short. Yeah. But saying that was actually my tool of the week. But you just ruined it for everyone. Oh, whatever, that was my tool. You would have nicked it. But I've got another one anyway, else. so. He'll need a ring yeah, just for the, the balls. Just for all the balls that he, 44 <laughs> balls that he's got. Yeah. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. But that is unbelievable. Ledge, Gordon Strachan came out and said, there's a deficiency. This is five foot five for Gordon Strachan. Yeah, yeah. Since he's been playing, there's been a deficiency in the Scottish team for that long. Well, that means that the whole of the Spanish side should not have got... Well, exactly. <laughs> Barcelona. <laughs> Barcelona, yeah, yeah. Real Madrid. I think it's a little bit of sour grapes of actually being uh, knocked out. Well, I just couldn't believe he actually said again. that. And with a straight face as well. Yeah. I, I got well, what did he say? I don't know what you're talking about. He's basically blamed their defeat and uh, not, and Scotland not qualifying Yeah. due to the fact that the Scottish team is shorter than the opposition that they play against throughout oh, the qualifying ridiculous. stages. That's ridiculous. Yeah, it's just... Not that they're shit or anything, what, but just yeah, exactly. What excuse would... You, if you were manager, what would you... Because you have to come up yeah, with yeah, something. Yeah, of course. No, I think that's what a great you, one. No, no, it's not very good. Well, it's got to be better than that. No, I'll just say, listen, you were shit. They're exactly. Us. But would you say the press? What would you say to the press? I'll say the exactly the same thing. Yeah, but Tim Sherwood was because guess what? You under the bus for that, wasn't he? No, but the thing is, Zane, you won't go out to the national... with the world's press... And turn around and say, oh, well, you know what? We lost that game because everybody was like six foot three and we're five foot five. We're not you under got, You've got to try and use it to your advantage. I always thought if I had a five aside team, I'd, I'd make sure they was dwarves. Yeah, because <laughs> you don't need height. Because yeah. head height, isn't it? Yeah. Five aside yeah. rule, head height. Yeah, you can't yeah. Is that right? Head yeah, yeah. Over head height. Yeah. And head height's much lower on a dwarves match. She no, not, if, you, not, if you're not a fan of your team of the dwarves. Oh, that's true, yeah. Whose yeah. head is it? Is this the yeah. height? Yeah. So whose head do they go on? Yeah, that's yeah. true. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. I'm well, that's a steward's that one. I just don't think that's me, catching on. Sure um, Messi, the was a dwarf. <laughs> Messi was a dwarf. <laughs> <though>. Messi <laughs> was a dwarf. <laughs> but they gave him injections, Barcelona. From Messi's when he never was. been a dwarf. No, but he, he wasn't a dwarf. He was like, he was small, though. He was just a small He was kid. medically small. I think he's about 5'5", five five, five, isn't he? Yeah, but that's because he had the injections. Are you injections with your pen there? Oh, really? Just demonstrating it, yeah. Yeah. Oh, so he had injections. Yeah, as a kid, they sent him to Barcelona. And Barcelona said, "We'll do all his medical because they knew he was yeah. brilliant at football, and we'll get him as tall as he can be." That's disgusting, and, though. Isn't it? Yeah, but I mean, where does Gordon Strachan get off and say that? So that means that Messi shouldn't be doing what he's doing now because he's five foot five. I think if you've got small players, then play it on the ground. I mean, yeah, pass, uh, it, pass and it around. How yeah. many hat tricks did you score, Ledge? Um, two, two, not four, four though. No, just two. Yeah, same feeling though. Get? Oh, 
Oh. Uh, yeah, have, you, have, have you played football? Have you played football? <laughs> 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 He's never played, has he? Who did you get hat tricks for? I didn't know that. Uh, Newcastle. Yeah. And against who? Uh, Newcastle against Antwerp in Europe. Mm. Okay. Belgium side. Correct, yeah. yeah. Do, you yeah. Know, do you know what, though? I'd have a one that I could out-sprint ledge over 100 metres, though. Oh, well, you know what? Oh, oh, no, oh, yeah. oh, yeah. yeah. oh, no way. It depends what you're chasing. <laughs> yeah. Like a fiver? Yeah. <laughs> I'd like to see that. Put bit. an ice cream if van in the mix. If it's an you investment bond, you're going to get there quicker than me. Who? <laughs> 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 investment bond, he'll get quicker than me. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah. What did you do with your money from last week, anyway? Did you invest it wisely? I invested it, yeah. <coughs> into, 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 oh yeah, into a share do portfolio. Do, did you win? Did you, uh, your, did Ricky you, won up, didn't you? I've done all right. I've done all right. Oh, but, come on, but you're I being modest. I lost you lo- won loads. No, you went into a gypsy trance to, to get that, those five, I did. three numbers. But did you see well, what well, I, well, I was doing? Well, I was on doing. fire in that you casino. You was like Ovey Brown from Ghost. I was on, I was on, I was. And you were piling the chips on single numbers they were coming in. I know. It was strange, man. But Rick, did you see what me and Ash was doing? I was just copying you. Yeah, we were copying. I saw you I copied him once and I thought, oh no, he won't be able to do it again. Then it came in again, the zero. I thought, oh, no. oh, that's it, I'll just copy it. It was people getting behind me, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah. Was. Like, yeah. little crowd. Yeah. And you yeah. see, they were looking a bit yeah. like they wanted to take you out, man. Like you was in a zone, big man. <laughs> I think you've got to be careful with a gambling trick, though. You, you can get hold of you. Oh, yeah. I think you've got to be Free very money careful. Like that. With, the, with the owner of the Golden Horseshoe, I had a tear in his eye when you left the table. Yeah. <laughs> gave, gave you some free <laughs> chips, wiped him out. <laughs> wiped yeah. him out, why not? And then the why free not? steak and chips. So are we actually going to talk about England's game at all or are we not going to bother, Ledge? Because well, I, I think this is one for you. It's just one of those things. It's your call. I, I didn't see it, so. Ash, did you see it? No. No. no, no. Anyone so see it? So boring. Do you know, mm. I, do you know is, it, is, it, is you just rubbish. falling out of love with it, though? Because I used to love watching England, but I didn't even watch them. I saw, I saw a bit of the highlight. I saw... I saw uh, Rashford, I saw he did he did a few good things. Yeah, uh, Rashford's good. I saw Deli Alley. He, he did another dive, but he got away with it this time, got the penalty. Yeah. Oh, did he? Yeah. Did yeah. you see how so empty though Wembley was though the first game? Yeah, but I think that's just typical of where England is at at the minute. Mm. You know, like you I, I, I honestly, watch I watch honestly didn't believe the, the second game. I, I didn't know it was on. I genuinely didn't know. It was really? Yeah. Do you know what? I'd rather. Harry Winks <laughs> made his debut, didn't he? Or I'd rather see go. England get thrashed <laughs> and try it and do something exciting, get the ball and go for the goal, rather than just keep tipping it about to each other and nothing happening. It's just they so boring. I think they've boring. done well qualifying, but the group was yeah, easy. Yeah, but we beat Slovenia one 0 yeah, That's and we're going to go and win the World Cup. Yeah. So, you, you, what chance right. have we got in the World Cup? None at all. Well, what what about America then? They're spending billions of pounds on uh, their soccer, and they've been knocked out. That's just uh, rubbish. Their infrastructure, hasn't it? Well, yeah, well, what are they spending billions of pounds on? What I don't know what they're. No, I think yeah, their they're infrastructure they're, they're spending money on. Zane, I don't think he's on players like w- what we do. I think he's on about building stadiums because right. they just they just bought a new team. That doesn't in help David Beckham's team's trying to get in there as well. Yeah, but I say that doesn't help your national team. But that doesn't so help your national team, and I just think they just haven't got any good players. But if you if you've got a country that size, that name can't me one good American player Cup at this moment in time. Lexi Lalas, he was good yeah. in what? his day. Argentina, yeah. they're Case, not going to qualify, Keller? are they? Argentina, Argentina yeah, he's retired they're now. not going to qualify. I don't think Argentina. Are Maybe, they? Oh, they they they're, they're one. oh, they have now. They won yeah. three one. Three Holland, one. Holland, Holland are out. Holland are out. Holland are out. Yeah. Holland are out. Italy is struggling. They're, they're in the playoffs. But how do you get all revved up for next year? Because we'll have a World Cup. Know. Historically, you do love a World Cup, but I just can't say I'm looking forward to it. All the Holland lot was all stone, weren't they? Was all <laughs> yeah. And they were just yeah. sitting on the bench, like, yeah. just out yeah. of their nuts. Shexy football. Shexy football. That's what they do, a shrewd holler, don't they? Is that how you used to talk? Yeah, yeah. To be fair. Yeah. Shit, yeah. Come on, guys. Why Tell us some more stories. Shucking and fucking. I'm going all that for Newcastle days here. Yeah, that's some of Rue Hullet stories, Ledge. What's that? I haven't got Newcastle days. I took no notice of him. So what happened? You must have had a story, though, when he came in, mugged you right off and made you look like such a wanker in front of everybody when he stripped you of your captaincy. Oh, yeah, that's nice, an old story. It's an old story. It's a bitter story. A bitter story. I don't, I don't like going back, do I, Rick? No, no. not sad stuff like, like that. Puts about the therapy and stuff. Sad <laughs> music. <laughs> I really don't want to go back there. He don't want to go back there. Don't, really don't, back don't back make him relive it. Let's talk about porridge. Yeah. Let's talk about you, Rick. So Because you're in it this Friday. I'm in it this Friday. Yes. Yeah. First first step last... last uh, listen, I think the, the papers had a right pop at it, but everyone knew that was going to happen. Just it's always hard when you're competing against something that's, that's I'm gonna so be, powerful. I'm going to be truthful, though. I think the episodes, not not just because I'm in them, but I think the episodes start to get better and better. Because you're in it, Rick. Yeah, yeah to yes. I'm in it, of course. course. Yeah. But, no, but yeah. I mean, I, I do think it livens up. And the other thing is, though, when you... Li- 
the, the blokes who wrote this are 80 and 81, the original yeah. writers. So, of course, they're not going to be doing, you know, writing stuff like sort of Alan Partridge and stuff that's more yeah. sort of recent breaking yeah. ground comedy. It's going to be that sort of old style sitcom type of comedy. And so you either got to, you know, respect it for what it is and, and watch it for what it is or don't watch it. The main character, though, did they tell him to be very much like Ronnie Barker because no. he's his granddad? Do you know what? I'll tell you something, and, and, and this is not just because he's my mate, because I'm quite sort of straight on things like this. Kevin Bishop is easily one of the best um, impressionists I know. Yeah, yeah. He can really do, he can do, he, if he spends five minutes with any of us, he'll have That's you it. absolutely spot on. He's brilliant. And if he wanted to do Ronnie Barker, he, 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 he would have done Ronnie Barker inside out. But what he'd done, he'd done just enough of the pattern, the rhythm of the way he talks, yeah. a couple of his little habits, which to me is sort of a genius. He's sort of yeah. nodding his hat at him, but not trying so to... So he's a grandson, so he's got a bit of... He would have a bit of it. He would have a bit of it, in it. Yeah. You know, and, and right. so what he, what he was doing there, really, he's sort of trying to say to the old fans, he is, look, you know, we, we, we're trying to keep it in the same vein. Yeah, yeah. And it's also... Even more so with like the Mackay characters, you know, you know Mark Bonner played and and also Dominic, it, you know they, they've sort of tipped their hat to them. Lucky enough, my character is a sort of a, a new character to the prison. It's a bit more yeah. sort of edgy. So you felt free to be yourself, or yeah, and they let and they, they let me sort of improvise a little bit. And the other thing we thought it was going out at eight o'clock. So it was very tame because it was for an eight o'clock audience. It actually yeah. went out at half nine. I think it's going to be going out at half nine. So we could have been a lot more edgy. You could have had all the spice, you know, all yeah. the uh, on spice oh, phones up their bums and stuff like yeah. that. Oh, you know yeah. what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> I've that, got, I've got one enough. up there as they we speak, Ash. telephones <laughs> up their uh, asses. Yeah. That's how you that's get away yeah. 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 you, 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 you can buy phones like that. Big. Yeah. I mean, even that, I'd struggle, but there's some people, they practice it. You know way too much about it. You know way too much about it. I heard you had one of them. Each phone you get in there. Yeah. Don't He's try and change the get subject. Get I heard you have one of them brick phones up your ass. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll just yeah, do that. I'll ring myself every now and then <laughs> to vibrate it. Oh, you know, yeah, just just it, said, yeah, you're sitting there smiling <laughs> on the yeah. tube. Yeah, exactly. And play a bit of music out of <laughs> it. Play a bit of music yeah. out of your ass. Oh, but, uh, yeah, no, yeah. they call it the bank, actually. Because I've got a, a few acquaintances who ended up behind what they bars. Call what the bank? They, you, you call your bum the bank yep. and they say I'm going to put it in the bank. Yeah. No. <laughs> 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 everything they've got, everything they've got goes goes up. As yeah. a certain smell. Goes up your it. bottle. Oh, you're lucky you ain't got a rocking horse or something. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. You wouldn't want to be a bank robber in there, would you? <laughs> no, no. Oh, no, dear, no. <laughs> Big spike. Or making a withdrawal. <laughs> <laughs> making a withdrawal. <laughs> or a deposit. <laughs> or a deposit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, terrible. Yeah. Oh, Look at Ash, my guy. What's happened to our show today, lads? The football's just all gone out of it, hasn't it? It's I don't know. Has it come to we're, this? We're back in the prem at the weekend, so we've got some decent. So we're back football. to normal. Back to normal. Yeah. Zane's got his sensible word on. He wants to talk about. He's got his sensible shirt on as well today. Sun's out, guns out. Oh, oh look yeah. at that! What, what an athlete! athlete. Yeah. What an athlete! What an athlete! No, we've got got some good games. Liverpool, Man United at the weekend. Yes, yes, that's going to be a very good game. I think Man United will win that one. Obviously, the Premier game, Spurs, Bournemouth, but we can talk about that in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> the Premier <laughs> game. Do you know what? There, I'm going to be true. Oh, there, there's certain and games Wembley, I'd yeah, watch now. Yeah. I, w I would I watch Man United. I watch Man City. You know, there, there are certain certain teams that I watch that I know is going to give me something. You know, give a bit of excitement. But the majority of stuff out there at the moment I'm seeing. But I'll tell you what, the, the, the Liverpool Man United game would be fantastic. That looks game. good. That's it's more to watch. You watch a good football match because of pl certain players that are in it. It's yeah. not really about the team. If there's a certain player you want to watch, like Ronaldo or that's you true. Know, whatever, that's when you want to you want to see them. It's about the individual, isn't it? It's like yeah. if you go into a barber's ash. Yeah. Say you was to walk into V Dell. What's that? Yeah. What's that? What's this barber's yeah, house? That, that, that's confused him, isn't it? Barber. You don't know where, where I'm yeah. coming from, do you? But it's not about where you go, you know, Tony and Guy or whatever. Yeah. It's about who actually does your ear. Exactly. There you go. So who it. is it, Ash? Uh, it's Tell Bert, us. A guy called Bernard. Is it? Uh, the Hagley Road in uh, Bearwood, Birmingham. Is it? In Bearwood. Yeah, but I haven't been there for like, you know, oh, I mean, for 12 years. years. <laughs> <laughs> I think he's been dead. dead about been 14 years. Weeks. Oh, he's been dead? Yeah, I think so. I he's dead. Are you paying how much? Not, like, I hope not, but I'm just guessing he will be. <laughs> By the time you've got to see him again. What is it? <laughs> Ash, I'm not having a pop with you, but yeah. what is it you actually say? You know, like, because people go in with a picture. You know what I mean? Yeah, I don't know. I normally say I don't know. 
I don't know what I, I want. I think you have the Mickey Flanagan, don't you? Yeah, or I the Dougal. So as I say layer it, I say layer, <laughs> I say layer, it. layer it. I don't know what that means. I go, but I know it's Rick, something. you should know. You, you, you were a hairdresser. I know, that's what I'm asking. Yeah. Maybe you should cut my hair What would you do? You should do it live on here. I'll tell you what I'd do. short, but I mean, you know, change. Why don't, we do, a, why don't we do a live live yeah. haircut? Live you get your scissors out, out live. for comic I'll, relief. Yeah. We'll do it for... Well, no, don't take it off. Cherry. What? No, no, just, you know, the ends and that. And a bit <laughs> no, of yeah. Layering. No, go, no go, they've go, already go said do it for charity. And I'll say, I'll do it for charity, but I want my cut. I <laughs> think we'll... I want five grand. <laughs> do you know what I think we and should do? Chari- you know, yeah. I mean, you got this is what we should do. Everyone's going to be a pint. winner. Everyone's yeah. going to be a winner. We do a charity haircut, yeah. right? And, and we get our listeners to vote in what footballer I should cut Ash's hair like. Oh, oh yeah, that's really good. That's the last you like. Ash's hair like. I'm tying it all in. <laughs> no, that's, that's not yeah, a good idea. Yeah, why don't Shearer? Who's that? 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 Who's there's no, Marnie. There's a little blonde no, bit there. No, not Marnie, not Pogba. Yeah, Pogba. Who is it? Pogba's, Pogba's got, got like a gold, bit, a gold bit on the side, though. Yeah. Gold bit on the side. Uh, that's a bit of you, eh? Gold, gold bit on the side. Don't cut it, just rock. put a gold bit. Do you in, imagine your, in that? your day, you had a real rascal haircut. Oh, there was loads of rascal haircuts. I mean, Bez's was quite rascal. There was a few mullets in there, wasn't there? Yeah, Bez's had a mullet. Yeah, mullet. We had a few mullets in the old days. I had a bit of a mullet myself. A mullet. I could yeah, have a mullet. Yeah, everyone had a mullet. Did you? Yeah, a bit yeah. Of a mullet. Yeah. I'd have a mullet. I don't mind a mullet. I mean, this well, is sort of mullet. like a mullet, isn't it? That's just hair. It's not quite a mullet. No, I'm going to do the... Go- <laughs> I'm going to do That's the... Uh, hair. That's uh, hair. Who's, <laughs> who's got the gold bit on his hair? <laughs> yeah, no, I don't want the gold bit on me. No, you're going to have the gold bit on here, and I'm going to tell you what you're going to do, Ash. You're going to go back to that ball with your new gold haircut oh, and God, you're going to grab imagine? it by the arms. You watch it, it'll shit itself. Yeah. Like, 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 look at it right in the eye anyway, with your new little yeah. haircut and your little gold bit. Yeah. And On say, a serious note, Ash, what was the last time you had your haircut? Um, what, I actually trimmed it myself actually, a couple of weeks ago. Oh, I thought so, yeah. yeah. You do it yourself, Ash? Yeah. Well, no, there's, I've got to get this barber's dye mirror. He's got a parrot, actually. Does uh, like go what? Well, you just go and see the parrot. Yeah. Let's go what? A parrot. Oh, I like that one, Lynch. I like that one. That was good. That one's the best. He's pleased with that one. He's pleased with that one. Go and have a lay down there, Rob. Yeah, so, you know, I'll go down and I don't know what to ask for, so I'll just go, look, just cut it a bit. What? And layer it. Does the parrot. Sound yeah, it does some of the McDonald's uh, <laughs> phrases, like it does the whistle and that. And oh, 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 that's <laughs> the McDonald's I don't know if it's a sponsored parrot or what. <laughs> Where is, yeah, this? What? is this? Is this in Finchley, Ash? Yeah, Hendon. Next to the, uh, yeah, right next to the ball. Down the high street. In the high street. Yeah, in next street. to the ball. There's a parrot and, uh, yeah, it's oh, someone was put out on the street. Oh, really? Chilling, yeah. I'm is. really starting to think Ash lives on the farm, but he just doesn't realise. No, I, 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 I want to go to Finchley. There's yeah. balls, balls and balls and parrots. I just no, think Ash cuts his hair. He's got to be a millionaire. Fact. Yeah, who's that? Hundred percent. Cuts his hair himself. A millionaire. I just, I just, I just, uh, no, I do it with my beard trimmer now. I feel it, it's actually better than the scissors while I'm trimming my beard. Yeah, but how do you do the back of it? You actually trim your beard. Well, it's long enough. I bring it around the front. You know, it's just, oh, all right. Oh, who's so, that? Who's that? Uh, oh, wait. Uh, it's uh, it's disgusting. Completely <laughs> ruined the show. Yeah, who is it? Oh, no. Oh, we've imagine got all, the, all the football fans Why out there out? thinking, listen, I was really getting into that yeah. football uh, conversation. Yeah. That is terrible. Why is your I phone know, on, mate? You. Oh, every week. Every week is every you. Every week. Can't right, take you anywhere. Ballon d'Or. Can we talk about mm, that? Yes. Lex, have you ever been nominated for a Ballon d'Or? No. Do you know anyone that ever has? Alan Shearer. Oh, is it? Yeah. He won, didn't, no, he didn't win. No, he didn't win. No, he didn't come third. Michael David, Owen, David Michael Ginola, Michael every Michael year. Michael Owen won, I think. He mm. did win. I did yeah. win, yeah. Michael Owen won, yeah. What's Ballon d'Or? What is it? Oh, best, best, best footballer in the world, isn't it? Yeah. There you go, Rick. Voted Rick. by the professional, is it by I, all I people? think the last, 11, the last 11 France. years, Messi's won it six times, Ronaldo's won it five times. So Harry yeah. Kane's been nominated. But he's yeah, he can't be. Look, yeah, but he's not even get sniff. But how, is, how, is, how does Eden Hazard... Who votes for this? It's a committee in France. Well, you should know, Rob. Well, I don't vote for it. <laughs> it's not the PFA. Okay, it's not the PFA <laughs> team. Have you ever played for the PFA team? I remember you threw a few PFA yeah. teams. Oh, oh you saw a few great How, how many teams, teams were you in? Eight, Did you have a present? Were you consistent? Uh, yeah, consistent over two years. <laughs> in your 25 year career two great years <laughs> PFA team of the year that used to be really good I used to God, like everyone that. used to look so forward to that didn't it yeah it used to be really good even now that, that's that gone yeah. downhill that's you used to get loads of players going they don't anymore no 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 one they just it's toss all, it off it's all now. agents and idiots yeah 
Agents. It's gone to pot. Take out all the tables now, don't they? Take out all the tables. It's gone to pot. They used to be good. Go on, Zane, you look like you're going to say something. Even Hazard. Yeah. He's been injured for six months. Harry's even. It's the same reason why Harry Weeks got into the England team. Depends what it's voted for, isn't it? Yeah, and when it was voted. It's like the player of the year for England, for, for in our country. It's voted for by, you know, by February, March. Yeah. But Mbappe played three games last year. Good he, game. Harry Winks has got into the England team. Hang on a minute, he is gone. Hang on. What's We're happening? Gone, eh? Can't hear you, Zane. No, I can't hear myself either. Well, thank God for that, Zane. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> <You've> gone. <laughs> right, Mbappe, you are saying? Has he in it? Huh? Has he in it? He's, he's just a top player. I he's think they're, they're, they're just all names that you would put in it, not really, aren't they? How about Kante? Kante yeah. deserves... Kante's deserve, in there. Yeah, he's a deserved shot. Tony Cruz, no? Harry Kane, Matt Hummels. Matt Hummels. Matt Hummels. <sighs> just token, isn't it? Token defender in there. Yeah. But no, I, I, I'm not. It'd be, it'd be out of Messi and Ronaldo, and, and rightly so. So take us back, Ledge. When you was playing, and the PFA list was getting thrown around in the changing room, and the teams was getting sorted out, did you look forward to actually seeing Rob Lee... On the wing, on the wing, like when you're when they're doing a the team of the year. I did well on the wing. What did you play in the midfield? I played in the midfield. But you was a winger. I was not a winger. What inside right? No, inside right. God, how old God, are that's you? That's old school, isn't it? No, I was, I was in midfield. Yeah, four four two. Four four two, old school. Yeah, old school it was. Yeah, yeah. You, voted, you voted for four midfielders, two two forwards, four defenders. Who always took your vote? Uh, I always, well, Gaz always when he was in the Premier League, I voted for Gaz a lot. Beckham got voted for a lot. Yeah. Um, you forwards are usually the same. Allen must have been Every nine season, out of yeah. ten. Yeah, I think. Um, and then we was next to him, Sheringham, Owen. Um, there'll be a few of them like that. So, so, but I, th- I think it's all it's all changed now. So it's it's voted so early. It's voted in March. If you have yeah. a really good March to the end of the season, which is when some players do, it doesn't you know, count. You don't count. It doesn't yeah. count at all. The votes have died so so early. Is it horrifically corrupt? What the voting? Yeah, I don't know, Reg. What would you reckon? Um, I, I don't see the point of. No, I, I, I don't, don't see the point of it. Really. In it yeah, there's no corrupt. value in it. Yeah, it seems to be accurate though. But if you're not in the Spanish league, right you don't win, do you? Wins, don't, yeah, yeah. It's, yeah, they're not they're not often far off with, with yeah. the right person getting in there and winning it. I yeah. don't, I don't think if yeah. you're taking it from when the season starts till yeah. March. They usually they. It's, it's just Ronaldo it's players and Messi that last. Yeah. What seven eight years or four? Well, Ballon d'Or is slightly different because I don't I don't think players vote for that. Right, right. But no, they, they they a, the Ballon d'Or is a committee. Yeah. But they're based Ronaldo in France. Ronaldo and Messi have won that both. In, uh, they've, it's only them that have won it last yeah. about five. The only people years. that changes yeah, is the person years. that comes yeah. third place, yeah. Rick. Yeah. <laughs> the one and so two. It's, it's the just if they did it, and every you know every t- every player in Europe got a vote. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I think I think you see you see different, different people. Different yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's right though because they are the two best players. That have been they in have, the last they have been, years. Yeah, they have been. I mean, yeah. Yeah. You look at Harry Kane's record, though. Harry Kane's record is better than theirs over the last year. Yeah, it is, yeah. Over but the last win. year. It is, yeah. is Messi as good as Ronaldo? Because I, f- mm. I, I, well, I think Ronaldo's like... You prefer Messi, don't you, Rich? You're, I, I you're like of a Messi, Messi man, I like yeah. Messi, yeah. I well, I like Ronaldo because he's like, he's like from the future, isn't he? The way he plays. like Messi plays like Maradona, you know, the way he runs. But when, the, when you saw Ronaldo, he's like an alien. He's almost like, you know <laughs> what I mean? He's like futuristic. It's like how all players will play in like hundred years or something. Do you know? Yeah. Do you know but he wouldn't, he, he wouldn't be able yeah. yeah. to play his game yeah. like that in the Premiership, surely. It just you'd have some six foot five defender yeah. guy knock him down, wouldn't you? Yeah, but he's he's so quick and. Well, like Ronaldo in the Premiership, like, no, no, like Messi, in the no Messi. But Messi, would, Messi him, listen, listen, you'd, you'd probably get that if Messi was playing for one of the lower league teams in the Premier League. He wouldn't get near him. But in, he's playing for a top team, which he would do. You yeah, he would only go to a Man United or Man City. Oh, I wouldn't want to man mark him. <laughs> Old no, school, man, man mark. Yeah. Messi, God. Who, who would you rather be marking, Messi or Ronaldo? I, I think I'd actually rather mark Ronaldo, I think. Really? Yeah, yeah I think so, yeah. I'd mess his hair up and stuff. and Yeah, pinch him. Yeah, give him a little, give a little pinch under the arm. Because it hurts. Cause apparently, he never, he <laughs> ne- he never <laughs> really used to talk to anybody in the Man United side. He just used to kind of snub everyone. Yeah, well, I've, I've heard stories about that before, but I think, you know, speaking to people that I knew at Man United that played with him, he was just a... Uh, a young player that came there in a massive club and he just needed to find his way. And I think when he f- did find his way after his antics of diving around week on week and he got sorted out by a few of the He was players. very young. Was he 18, was very young, he very young. And he came like for big money as well, 12 21, million. 21, did he? 22. Exactly. You could see so how good he was straight away though, couldn't you? Yeah, you could yeah. see that. But again, yeah. it was a case of, you know, 
the way they what the way he was used to playing that um sporting was completely different what yeah yeah you know what they was expected from him at yeah. Man United, and I think the they the always contact all was stop different. showboat and stop showing off. They yeah. used to say to him, and, and I yeah. think hey, if you do a step over that, you know, you send someone out the stadium and have to pay to so get I back I in. They're going to do like, you next like time. Him yeah, and Messi, yeah. that, that, it, especially him, it's, it's a huge miss from the Premier League. Like, like we're yeah, talking about yeah. entertainment and people getting yeah. your bums off your seats and actually watching. Like That's that, why yeah. England's so boring. Yeah, we have yeah. not got one player. You no. think I want to see him play? Why is that? Why is that? Well, I, I, think, money, I think it's because it's, it's, it's the way that the, the Premier League has played it. As I said before, I think it's all played like you you stand there, you stand. We won't lose this game, and yeah. we've got athletes that run up and down. And I, they I don't think nobody likes the much. players that are there. But you know what? It's funny. I I, I read um, something in the paper yesterday. Howard Wilkinson, um, he was a director of football um, back in the late nineties, and he implemented the whole youth team structure as we know it today. And he come up, he came out in his piece yesterday saying that the system that he put in place, saying so to answer that England question, why we're not producing players, he's the person that put implemented that saying is out of date now. There's no way yeah, but, a yeah, player could how come Wilkinson through. played boring football, but it, it so why is he him. implementing it for us? But this is what happens. Dan Ashworth has I, now I, got his I job. What's Dan Ashworth I, how Wilkinson implemented that for our youth, and it's come exactly what he, he thought it would be. Exactly, he, he got players that how Wilson would love to have. They're all athletes. They're all. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Rick, wake up. <laughs> Rick, <laughs> Rick. Rick. You, know, you, know, you know Ash does um, impressions, <laughs> don't you? No. Nah, do Ash? Ash, do an impression, Ash. Well, I don't, I don't do Yeah, you do, well. Ash. Come well, on. I, do I was with you the, the other day. Oh. We was yeah, outside what? the station. You'd done Chris Eubank. Oh, yes. Chris Eubank, yes. But everybody does Chris Eubank. <laughs> that's, 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 that's very good. Very good. That's do. very good. Who yeah. else you do, Ash? No, that's it. Just Chris Eubank. You must. I, have, oh, you did uh, someone else. Nigel earlier. Nigel Farage. Oh yeah. And great. Well, that's it. I've got a script though. You know what I mean? Give me, give me some something to work with. Yeah, give me something to work with, man. All right. right. We're well, talking about something. talk give about something. football like Nigel Farage. <laughs> uh, well, I uh, think England uh, are not doing uh, too well, and uh, we, we might be doing uh, a lot better after Brexit. <laughs> 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 See, I told you, he knows everything. That boy. That's why I brought him in. <laughs> So that's it, Chris Eubank and uh, Farage. Nigel Farage. Yeah. Yeah. Well, Chris good, Eubank, then. Yeah. Let's talk about the boy. Do you yeah. watch his fight the weekend? Yeah, Rick? fantastic. Do you know what? He's getting better and better. Um, and that knockout he done was fantastic. We've got nothing coming through our ears, though. I'm just letting you know. Are we still recording? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Right. Right, no yeah, problem. we need a new splitter, Rick. Okay, it's no, in the post. No, no, in the post. no problem. So, yeah, I think, you know, Chris Eubank's... Junior is incredible fighter, and that knockout he done is showing now that he's a banger as well. He's a machine, isn't he? Is yeah. yeah, I mean the That's exactly what you because his dad has, has trained him, isn't he? He's done what he said. He said, "I, I'm going to make so sure my son is uh, is." He's but doing these, do, it, do it the way he was said. I didn't wait. I'm going to make sure. I didn't want my son to go into <laughs> boxing, but if he is going to go into boxing, I'm going to tell him and manage him and make sure he's safe. I tell you, I've trained him much better than ever I was, and he's a machine. Please, and I'm scared, please, can I I'm say? Scared for the please, opponents. please, can I say <laughs> firstly, please? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. We, we should all just be so <laughs> like, let's do the rest of the show. I can't do it. I can't do it. Please, do you think? I am a, I am a, a I am a boxer, not <laughs> a fighter. Yeah. Um, yeah, he God. pretends no, to be fantastic. too much like his dad. He should have his own. No, but the thing is, I, I don't think he's anything like his dad in terms of his fighting style. I think his mannerisms, you know, the ring walk and the way like he was, his stance and everything else. He, and he moves like in certain yeah. elements when he's not engaging in contact like his dad. I think that's just a show factor. Yeah. But if you have a look at his technical ability, I think he's way superior than his father's. Because they're talking about him, George Groves. I'll tell you something. I'll tell you something. No, I don't think so. I think you would, Rick. I don't, I don't, I don't think so. I don't, the only Do you thing, think George Groves would beat him? Well, I'm telling you what, you... George Groves is a fantastic fighter. The only thing that may have happened, he may have had too many hard fights because mm. he, he's, he's been in some real he wars. Was, he? He's been in some real wars. But it's such a shame, really. He, everyone's got a bogeyman and sometimes styles clash. It doesn't mean because he can beat him, he'll beat him. So when he, you know, um, when he was up against Frotch and that, it, it, it didn't so it did, did not suit him, you know. Well, he had Frotch going at one he stage. He had Frotch and going, and, and, and Frotch was through 
a wonder punch and sparked well, him. Well, not only that, Froshy's a bit of a throwback. He, he he doesn't do anything. He's got zero technical. He ability, doesn't do he? anything great. He's just so strong and so eager to win. Well, was that through. when Frosh knocked out Groves in front of ninety five thousand people at Wembley? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah it's a, exactly. You know, but these things happen. I promise you. You know, you, you the average person on the street they get it by a pro boxer. It's like. They'd, they'd be in a coma or, or dead. You know, that's how hard these people oh, are punching. You, can you put that to the test? Just give Rob a quick... <laughs> I was going to give him a little <laughs> clip, actually, earlier on. I was, think, I was thinking I've about it this week. <laughs> <laughs> I've, I've been, been really sleep good this week. week. <laughs> he has been good. Last week, it was really spiteful. You're in two weeks, I, never, well. I haven't slept for a week. I've been in a terrible state. <laughs> You're in two weeks. Uh, um, so, <laughs> so, yeah, you know, so uh, for, for me... I'm finding, you know, the boxing at the moment much more exciting than the football. And, I, and when I when I saw that um, when I saw that knockout, yeah, it, it's it's going to be a him and scary, gross. Wasn't it? it was scary. Would he scary. Been his dad in his A day? Who would have won? Do you know what? I was just, that's what I was going to say earlier. Was a lot. Chris Eubank Senior was an absolute fantastic yeah. fighter, yeah, yeah, didn't he? And, and the fights he had with Nigel Ben was so exciting. And yeah. for me, it, it's a shame. I don't think because of the weight difference, obviously it's never going to happen between the two sons. Yeah, but, you know, Conor Ben, he's he's, he's incredible fighter as well. Because Conor would have to go up too much and Chris couldn't go down that small. E exactly. And, I, you know, so there's this difference in size there. But but for me, I think Chris Eubanks Jr. is going towards being a better fighter. Yeah. You know, but at the moment, you can't say he's better than what his dad was. His dad's crackers. Yeah, you know, he, hasn't let, achieved, let, he hasn't achieved. He, he's he's hasn't stone achieved raving it. mad, but he's he's. When I say stone well, raving, he's, he's an eccentric. Mad, but not at boxing. He knows he's an what eccentric. He's doing of course he does. And oh, of course he's doing he's his business deals as well. Of course he does. TV deals. But you know, I understand what you're saying. He's emulating him in the fact that when he knocked that geezer out, he stood over him. It was very Chris Banks senior yeah, yeah. style when he just stood over him and looked at him. But the build up to this fight has been. It's been really weird because the fellas' manager, the Turkish fellas' manager, oh, no, he went so nuts, didn't he? aggressive. He went nuts. Didn't it he? seems like a complete bully. So aggressive and and and, and was really. I thought I was. It's going to go off outside. He looked very. Uh, yeah, so over the top, really over the top. But um. But what does he? What does his old man say? Because for me, Eubank Senior, after the Watson thing, he kind of lost his killer. He always he's held back. Didn't oh, and I think he's come yeah. out and said that in his. If you've yeah. seen any of So, what, what does he say that? to the boy? You don't hold back because well, I held back and that hindered me a little bit towards well, you the end. You put yourself in danger, don't you, if you at all. <laughs> But yeah. was like, he fought someone recently and he, the kid ended up in hospital in a real yeah. bad way. And he I did, think his yeah. dad came out in a post Stunned fight him to the head. and said to him, Look, stop. Like, he told his son not to go to the head, but not just to go to the, the body. fight to protect his son because he wasn't going down from the head punches and he just wanted to end the fight and he was just trying no, to knock him out from the body. Yeah, because he knew the shot. boy took too but much shots. He to the said, head. Oh, I did that to protect the other fight. Uh, that was just yeah. Bollocks. What, what you've said, Ash, is correct. Do you yeah, reckon? Yeah, 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 what he said is correct. He got on that thing that he was saying, hit him to the body, like to protect him, but it, it wasn't. Yeah, the reason was exactly what Ash is saying is that he wasn't having, he was hitting him with everything to the head and he wasn't really having that much of an effect. But it did. Obviously, it, it did. It had an effect. It had a so massive whatever effect. He was saying yeah, that. But he, he was predicted. He, he was no, but he was predicting what was going to happen. Yeah, but I, I, I forget when the kid when, wasn't going to go down. No, but the thing is, when you've been in that situation, I actually listen. Maybe I'm wrong. I'm, I've never been a boxer, yeah. Rick. So yeah. you probably know a lot more than me and uh, Leggy would know. But yeah. it's, yeah, a case, <laughs> it's a case. It's a case of. He's are we still in boxing? I've been a Lewin back. Are we still? Are we still in the boxing? Are we still on today? But I just think Chris had a point because I think if he didn't do it, maybe he would have known. The boy might not he have made it to hospital. He he well, of course he's going to care about his son. Who wouldn't? He wasn't worried of anything about the other If guy. you're worried about he's the opponent, you'll be, be you'll, you'll be looking at the ref all the time and saying, ref, stop he this. He did want the ref did. to stop you know. He did. He also but didn't want to say yeah. his son would win. I mean, he wasn't really... He, did, he, he knew the fight was over as well. Mm. And it, the ref should have actually stopped it. I, I think just think he got on the... The guy was staying up, so... I think you could stay up... And get well, you know, brain which, bleeding yeah, of while he was, you know, boxing. You know, boxing is a is a dangerous sport. Yeah, and and, and you know, you know what you do. It's big. It's big prizes, but you know, there's big risks, and that, and and that's the way it works. That's Whereas it football, works. big prizes, I no do. risk. PC people probably stop stop, <laughs> stop punches to the head soon, won't they? Yeah, they will. Yeah, yeah. they will. No, yeah. I'm, oh, I'm, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. Never. Even if they do, there will still be footballers rolling all around <laughs> the penalty area. I promise you, <laughs> screaming like women. <laughs> right. I should I, I should I say baby? Selby yeah, was that other boxer? Yeah. Hey? Selby, was Selby, Selby boxer yeah. The, the two just brothers, great Incredible. fighters. Unbelievable. He's like Muhammad Ali, but he kept putting his hands down, letting the other bloke hit him. Yeah. 
which was very silly. But yeah. He, the Selby brothers are, are, are fantastic fires, the pair of them. And, they're, you know, um, they're going to they're gonna reign for quite a long time. I think they're going to do really well. But what you said, you can't let, no matter how good you are, you can't yeah. start letting fighters just whack you. No, because that just and puts mileage on no, the top. And it was top entertainment. That's the sort of thing people like and yeah. will bring boxing back. It know? does, because you, you, you're looking for them characters. Let's face it, who wants to watch, you know, there was... Mm. Who wants to watch two technically great fighters having a technical fight? You watch boxing for the same reason yeah. I watch boxing. You want to get to see someone get knocked yeah. spark out yeah. by a big punch. That's why we watch it. That's the excitement of it. Let's get it right. Yeah. So unless you're a connoisseur of boxing and you're going, oh, what a lovely yeah. combination he done there. No one's interested in it's that. Excitement. I'd rather go and see a geezer with a pair of Wellingtons on and all his hair sticking up than yeah. I would someone who's technically great. I want to see, I want to see something <laughs> Ash, different. you're in there. <laughs> 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 I've got your fight Wednesday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you're <laughs> fighting <laughs> a ball <laughs> in Hendon. <laughs> <Yeah, laughs> I want the rematch, man. I've been looking for that. You, you want the rematch, rematch man? Yeah. That's a good person. Yeah, brilliant. Well, that brings us to our uh, weekend fixtures. Yeah, Should we quickly rush through, them? through them. Yes, yeah. yes. So you got the big one on Saturday, Liverpool, Man United. All right, Liverpool, gonna gonna pip them. Do you reckon? Yeah, Ma- Man United, no chance. Manchester, Man United, Man United Manchester. Man- 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 me and Robert, yeah. we're going together. Yeah, you're yeah. tight, aren't you? We're well, very we're tight. We're, we're very tight. tight. I don't know about anything else. Left-handed man with a right-handed pocket. Long pocket, short arms. Some advice you'd take, eh? Honestly. Right, you're old boys. <laughs> I was talking about money, Reg. West Ham. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, West Ham will win that. Yeah, you got yeah, West, West Ham, Ham will win that. Battle of Clarets and Blues, eh? Yeah, yeah. battle. No, Burnley's still colours. Yeah? Are you going Burnley? Yeah, I don't want to, but I, nil. but I think Burnley at home are You'll very be ashamed good. of yourself. I know, I should rig, but... You've, you've, you're out of our manner. Why are you know, doing this? Know, Why are you saying this? Burnley at home are very good and we're not There's our people sitting in pie mash shops crying now listening to this. We're not very good at the moment. But oh. we can come can back. We've got to come back. Claret and Blue because of Aston Villa. Oh, oh God. Oh, oh, yeah. oh, is that a fact? Is that is that why do you fact. actually play up there? Exactly hockey or something? Go on, give why us the you play up there? Well, well, Burnley, they took the colours just because Villa were like, you know, the top team of that, that era. And West Ham, one of their, the dad, the players' dads uh, was in Birmingham and had a bet against a couple of Villa players. He'd beat them in a sprint and he did. And they didn't have the money, so they gave him the kit, the villa kit. Who told you this? Wikipedia. <laughs> <laughs> I like Wikipedia. You yeah. believe, do you believe him? Oh. Yeah, no, do you yeah. believe, believe you, Wikipedia? You, Wikipedia. You, you, hold on a minute, I'm just letting you know. Yeah. The, the Wikipedia he's talking about is not the one we're talking about that you Google. <laughs> no, it's a special the Wikipedia. Wiki, this Wikipedia is a little geezer <laughs> in Finsley yeah. Yeah. called Wikipedia. Yeah. 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 It's Willie and Wikipedia, the twins. <laughs> the twins. Yeah. He knows everything. He knows everything. Willie's <laughs> useless. He's just getting pissed all the time. But uh, yeah, right. Willie's all right. All so right. we've got Palace. Chelsea, uh, another Chelsea. easy Chelsea. game for the Palace. Palace has <laughs> got to be 50 to 1 to win that, hasn't he? I mean, the Pelican. I'd have a the Pelican, the Pelican, the Pelican, Pelican is not yeah, yeah. 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 I feel sorry for him. You I feel, feel sorry for him. But yeah, what? I'm sitting here with that I'm big going, neck. I'm going 5 1. Who? Chelsea. Oh, wow. Palace going to score? How are they going to get the first goal? But they haven't got a goal in eight games. They'll get a goal, I guarantee you. reckon? Yeah, they'll get a goal. They'll get smashed, but they'll get a goal. Do you know what? I'm not into cruelty for animals and all that. But I think I may go over there with a slug rifle and put a pelican a out of his misery. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> because he's, that's gonna, he's gonna be in a terrible state. He's gonna slugs. watch his team get slaughtered. I cannot believe the time oh. in bringing that geezer in. He's regretting it. Oh, he's regretting it. <laughs> he's he should have he got away on a month's holiday before oh, he took mate, it. Let him have a month to think about it. <laughs> yeah. Talk yeah, about on an hiding to nothing. Do you think you could go into Palace now, bear in mind De Boer, Lost four. Hodgson's lost Arthur four. Could, do a great could job you go Palace. in and, and win a game in four for Palace? Well, I, I, I would say I can't do any worse, can I? No. No. So no, you've even got if a you job, get a draw. there you go. Yeah. <laughs> You're in. I guarantee, <laughs> I, go with that. I, I guarantee I won't do any worse than what they've done. <laughs> yeah. That's a great That's got to be a selling point, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'll get a meeting set up with Parrish. Yeah. Man City Stoke. Man City Stoke. Oh, City all day. City, City all day long. Yeah. Yeah. Big win. No chance. Big win. Yeah. Big win. I can't see anyone beating City. Yeah. Who can you see beating City? I no, don't I know. Can't, I Spurs. Can't. Come on, seriously. Uh, Be serious. They could have a bad It's day. a serious show, Zane. <laughs> you got more chance of Harry Kane becoming a bingo caller. <laughs> <laughs> 
Huddersfield. Swans at home. Draw. One one. Huddersfield away win. Spurs See when we do all this, what what does it do? We're just predicting. Just goes yeah, but what does it do? Does on everyone say. going oh Yeah, they really enjoy it, Rick. They 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 you've ruined it for everyone. Right, yeah. Carry on it. Carry on it. Carry on it. Carry on. My accumulator's fallen fallen by many, many people. Many, many people. It's people all over Dagnum as we speak. Taking the pen from behind their ear roll in the betting offices, writing these out. Oh, go on, Rob. Who's next? Exactly. Spurs, Bournemouth. Spurs win. There you go. Yep. Yep. Accumulator. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm going for Liverpool, Burnley, Chelsea, Man City, Swansea, Spurs. Accumulator, everyone. Yeah. I'm, Scott, I'm Scott going money. with Rob. It's got to be better than your dream team, Rob. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking what, hey. hey, Rubbish. No medals are given out now. I no. know, <laughs> oh, no, but Rob, I'm, catching, I'm catching Ricky up now. Yeah, I'm on, <laughs> I'm on his towel as we speak. <laughs> I'm on his towel. Watford, Arsenal. Watford. Watford, Arsenal. Yeah, Arsenal. Arsenal. Yeah, exactly. You never one. know. No, on a Sunday, big like one. Derby, Brighton. Hey? On a Sunday, like Brighton. Derby. Everton. I think Arsenal. Everton need to win that against Brighton. It's a must win for Everton. Yeah, isn't it? yeah, they have to win it. I think, otherwise he could be in trouble. So, um, Southampton, Newcastle. Southampton. Yeah. yeah, Newcastle never win at Southampton. <laughs> I'm going oh, to playing. Is he still yeah, playing? Probably turned up for that <laughs> game. Do you know what? I've got a feeling Newcastle are, g- are going to liven up. I'm going Newcastle wow. uh, away. Wow. I'm, g- I'm I'm going for it. Oh, yeah, I am. Yeah, just ignoring all history there. Aren't yeah, you? I don't yeah, care. Yeah, I don't good. care. I'm I'm like, and mark my words, what I said when we come back next week, you can you can look at me in the eye well, and he, t- is yeah. like, well, he does have that sort of skill. I put that you gypsy curse. Yeah, that's, that's put that gypsy curse. It's a long so. way from Newcastle to Southampton. You know what I mean? It's a long way. It is a long way. But they're going by air balloons, so it shouldn't take long. And strong wind, strong wind behind them. Strong gusts. Okay. Yeah. Right. Tour of the week. It's all of the week. Yeah, I've got a great one this week. Go on, then. It's great. Ed, not turned his phone off. Yeah. Oh, he's 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 did so well. well. well yeah. is, that, is that a final? Same, yeah, Are we actually going to find him? That's, yeah. that's, that's a, a Christmas gonna spot. Find yeah, yeah, that's, that's a, a good one. That is a Christmas Thanks, Zane. bottle of pink no, champagne fine. So. Yeah. But no, I, I last, last year... You wouldn't have been in the trenches with him, would you? No, he mended his ways last year. It was every <laughs> other episode <laughs> last year. This year he ain't had none. He's let himself down. Just slip off the old uh, switch. Don't you accident, bruv me. No, go that, that was a... No, good it. Good it. Right, Rob, I'll take that. Uh, well, I'm going to go sort of like a bit left field, but everyone's heard of him. Harvey Weinstein. Oh, oh no. Powerful. Powerful. Yeah, but Rob, no, you I'm said you got hard. your first acting powerful. job through him. Actually, it's had Zane got me on this show, to be fair. <laughs> I'm actually in the, in the process of suing him. Over but, the um, Holiday Inn, Rob. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going I'm I'm to roll my hands up here. If I come for a part, yep. and Harvey wanted to have a little fiddle yep. with me yep. nice on the choir. They give you the big part. Yeah, nice one, yeah. And I could have been like a new Rocky or something. I'd have said no. <laughs> no. No way in a million. No way in a million years. It's absolutely disgusting, isn't it? When yeah. you look at him, and and look at him knowing what he's done, he's like a big vile iguana. I don't know what he is. He's just got, he's just got something really <laughs> nasty would it, would it about. Would make him? a difference, right? If yeah. he looked like Brad Pitt, though. Oh yeah, all the difference in the world. You're right. What you're saying, it wouldn't make no difference. It wouldn't make no. I know. I know you so base yourself on Brad. Right. Yeah, but Brad Pitt yeah. wouldn't have had any complaints, would he? Let's be honest. <laughs> Do you know? But I just think. I just think it, as someone, someone in that position to be doing that. And what's even worse for me? I think what's even worse than him is the people around him who knew what was going on mm. and keeping Hiding, it to keeping themselves. Their jobs. You know, and there's some big jobs, names man. now who know what he's been up to and ain't come forward. And it just shows you, it just shows you what's going on in this world. And listen, they've said he's been sacked from his own firm. Let's put that right, right? He ain't been sacked from no firm. He's on holiday. He's always, well, he's a silent partner or whatever he is, but he'll still be reaping all the rewards from that firm. And I just think it's like, it's a re- it's a real disgusting thing that they've got a sort of white it's something like his firms add 300 Oscars or so ridiculous. Diabolical. But Diabolical. I mean, you not to have that sort of thing, but have you come across things like that? You've got some real obnoxious prat who's right high up. Yeah, not to mention names, but yeah, yeah. Well. you know, but I, I don't <laughs> really suffer that sort of thing. And, then, and, and, and when I sort of go in and see people, they're sort of normally 
they're normally nice but you this happened there and he just showed he's, he's sort of a, a real smur on his business you know but i want to get nicked over the next couple of weeks so that i can be in prison for christmas because you imagine the show that Harvey's going to put on in prison. Yeah. You're going to have, like, Gary Glitter. <laughs> Rolf will be doing a bit. Yeah. Oh, he's you know, do. Yeah. Uh, he's Max got Clifford a top... can do the publicity. Max Clifford can do oh, the PR. Yeah. Yeah. It, it's going to be yeah, an amazing brilliant. show in there. I want to oh. get in there for that Christmas show. <laughs> Jonathan yeah. King. Jonathan do, do King. Oh, yeah. Ash knows them all. Got got enough, enough, yeah. Actually, yeah. Got yeah. Boss, he's uh, got a couple of their phones up, he's like. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. One of them's ringing now. I think that's Jonathan King. Jonathan's on the phone now. Uh, it's a bit higher up, that one. Uh, mine is, I've got two tools of the week. Uh, the people that slagged off the Dove advert, you know, the soap advert. Oh, were, right, yeah, that's all they right. They said yeah. that, because it was at a... That Dove were doing an advert so, and they were basically showing it's good on all skin types, black people, white yeah. people, yeah. you know, Asian. And, and people, you know, the politically correct brigade went, oh, look, they're being racist. They're showing a black person and they're washing themselves and becoming white. <laughs> so they've totally, you know, oh. seen it, in it. So them. And uh, my other one is pandas. Just the act, because they just sit there eating bamboo and you can't even buy a panda. You have to rent it off the Chinese government. And right. it about 800 grand. <laughs> well, you know, so I was looking into where, it this where, week. Where, 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 uh, why? Why? You know, they just sit there <laughs> slapping their faces Rick, with This bamboo. is why I brought him in. This yeah. is exactly why This is why I brought him in, because I'm fed up talking about football. He's talking, don't it's, try buy listen to this man. Week. You won't be able to get one. I don't care who your contacts are. He's talking yeah. sense. You're yeah. talking yeah. sense. Yeah. sense yeah. Man. How much they cost to rent? Them? Earphones just come on. Earphones have just come on. You can rent one, though. You can. It's the only way you can get one. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, oh, true story. Yeah, rent panels. On that note, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> well, I've got to do mine. Yeah. Oh yeah, how, how about you, have me? You got one? I'm yeah. not even here. Yeah, yeah, go on, you do. No, no, go no, go no, go no, because you'll take mine. Yeah, you will. Yeah, yeah, it's true. <laughs> the earphones have come on ridiculous now. We've had no earphones. Do you know what? I've got to buy a new splitter and I didn't buy it in time, Rick. Oh, is that what it is? I put my hands up. All right, my Your fault as well. So then, what's two tools? That's two fines then. You go wide? No, one tool. Come on, one tool. Same grows. No, my one is. The Vice President of the United States, Mike Pence, I believe his name yeah, is. that yeah, right, Ash? That's right. Man. Yeah, because I know you're a bit of a Wikipedia confirmed. geezer. Yeah. Confirmed yeah. it. Well, confirmed he, it. He, he went to the Colts <laughs> match. In America, there is a lot of issues going on there about um, the NFL players taking a knee yeah. during the national anthem. Yeah. Which is a sign of protest against the brutality that's going on against people of the ethnic well, police shooting yeah. black people yeah you know, yeah, 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 right? yeah 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 so uh, a player by the name of colin kaepernick for yeah. uh was it 46 um yeah one of, the, one of the americans yeah, yeah he's yeah. quarterback he's he's he led the way by taking a knee oh on I remember, a, on, yeah on yeah, yeah i remember that yeah, yeah i remember that um, but anyway yeah. on saturday the vice president yeah okay uh yeah. mike pence decides to go and watch his beloved colts that he hasn't seen for three That's years it, yeah. yeah right and he was told that by Trump, if there anyone takes the knee while you're there, yeah, get on the plane and leave. Right. So obviously, the whole Colts boys took yeah. the knee. Yeah. And I'm thinking to myself, well, you knew exactly what's going to happen. Yeah, you knew. haven't been there for three years yeah. before going. You tweeted a picture that was three years old. Yeah. So yeah. you're going and knowing what's going to happen. What's yeah. going to happen? Yeah. So in a way, you're kind of poking a bear, so yeah. to speak. You yeah, know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. Of and um, he sends out a tweet after. Yeah. To Donald Trump, basically, I did what you said. I left there because I took a knee, and Donald Trump gave me yeah. the thumbs up. Yeah, useless. You're never yeah. going to solve anything like that, is it? No. And they're not disrespecting the flag. They're not disrespecting the anthem. They're making a point. They're making a point. That's they're standing they're up for something. They're, yeah. they're bringing attention to something that really needs to be highlighted in yeah, that yeah. Um, culture and that community. And I think it even comes closest to home over here as well. But I think um, when you look at it, it's a case. It's another case of like. Bullying, I should imagine yeah. by the Trump and the, yeah. and the president and these hierarchy, but he's yeah. definitely taking it. Yeah, calls himself a fan. He hasn't been there for three years. No, that's my. Oh, actually, actually, actually been a, a villa. <laughs> yeah, well, yeah, but that's just he doesn't like the, the food. They're the selling. Quality, yeah, the food's <laughs> yeah, bad. Yeah, yeah. But I mean, it's a terrible American restaurant. That villa. It, it's a terrible game, America. Yeah, it's football, awful. It? It's an awful game. Why would you? And Donald Trump said, if anyone doesn't take, um, doesn't stand during the national anthem, yeah. the NFL should sack him. And that's half the. Uh, but they are respecting NFL it because they're all black. Going yeah. on the knees, respecting it because if they were just, they just walk around, go. Yeah. <laughs> but they're sort of half respecting it oh, on their knee, aren't they? Yeah. 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 yeah that's no. mine anyway. No, that's a good one. Thank you.
I think my one is uh, Eubanks Junior fight was the um, the opposing. I think, was it Advil or something? His name? Yeah. The yeah. Turkish that's fight. Like tablet. Is it? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, he, well, that's what the geezer yeah. must have. Yeah, yeah. He probably needs after some that, of them yeah. after after, after getting a clump Eubanks. like that. I think you know he was just over the top with the, you know in the um, in in the pre-conference and all that. He was he was giving it all the big and about. He's dropping you know. the C bombs, wasn't yeah. he? Yeah, and he you know. Is that cookie? I, I you yeah. know. Uh, we're yeah. on that note, we'll see you all next week. We'll see you all next week.